Hello again, everyone. Edwin Lernard back once again. This YouTube segment, I want to talk about uh, the fact that we had no Powerball winners in last night's uh, drawing. The drawing was for nearly $950 million, and it may very well, uh, the amount may very well increase to $1.3 billion for Wednesday's drawing, which is the next one. Now, the odds of winning, as most of you may know, are very minuscule and they're astronomical. I mean, the odds are 1 in 292.2 million to win uh, the big jackpot. Now, the next drawing will be on Wednesday night. And, I mean, $1.3 billion obviously is nothing to scoff at or sneeze at. We all could use uh, that extra money. Even... Uh, even perhaps after taxes, after what Uncle Sam uh, will do to it. Now, but to put things in even bigger perspective as far as winning this jackpot, now, the odds of getting struck by lightning in your lifetime is 1 in 3,000. And in a single year, um, 1 in 700,000. Those odds are greater. I mean, you have a better chance of that happening is what I'm saying. Uh, than winning this jackpot. Now, everybody has their own view on, on what, how much money they want to spend if they do uh, take uh, part in this jackpot in, or in this Powerball drawing, I should say. You know, it, it doesn't pay to be a compulsive risk taker. I mean, my, my feeling is if you, only, you only live one time maybe go for it but don't but just do it in, in, in small doses I mean some people may want to play 20 or 100 purchase a hundred tickets I mean I, I wouldn't go over five but I guess a lot of this of course is proportionate uh, with one's budget and really uh, this is I thought was interesting is that there were 25 players that won 25 million uh, and then uh, in yesterday's drawing, and there were three people that won two million. So, but I think in this particular um, drawing, I think obviously I believe the chances of actually, of somebody actually winning it because due to the fact that this has gone on for a number of drawings without anybody winning and, and all this money is accumulated, that you figure somebody will more likely than not win uh, this drawing and, and maybe there'll be more people uh, playing because this amount has become so prodigious and so immense and this is really something that's been talked about uh, very frequently uh, I've seen people on my Facebook page be talking about this and they'll, they'll be joking and uh, maybe being serious well hey make sure uh, you give me some or I'm going to share my numbers with you you share yours with mine and if I win then you could win half and you know just things like that so it just really this has been something that has been of uh, a very strong uh, has figured prominently in many people's conversations and on the on the internet and so forth and so on and I understand the excitement surrounding this but as I stated before the odds of winning this are just very minuscule and I understand you got to be in it to win it. Uh, the thing is, though, you have to keep in mind and perspective that the odds are so much against you, it's not even uh, funny. Uh, somebody uh, I was watching, I think somebody fi that figures prominently in this lotto drawing said something like, who wants to be a billionaire? I got kind of a kick out of that. Well, kind of a rhetorical statement, I guess. I think many people would want to be uh, billionaire and the thing is I, I encourage I know many people most people won't see this video but if if you happen to see it and, and, and if you you may win I think the thing is is to just be be judicious with whatever uh, with what you get money is money I, I understand you can't take it with you when you go and uh, money can come and go very quickly and the thing is, though, I understand $1.3 billion, though, will we'll probably, whoever gets it, I imagine they're not going to squander all of it away before they, they die. And $1.3 billion 
is obviously nothing to scoff at or, or sneeze at for that matter. And I really, uh, what I want to close with is that I just wish everybody luck that sees this video. I think I might even play uh, one or two uh purchase one or two tickets myself because you just never know until you try right wasn't there a song by america uh some of you may have remembered this group they were a famous i believe soft rock group from the 70s and in that song it says you'll never know until you try well i guess the same principle applies for uh the lotto the powerball drawing for wednesday well anyway people this is edwin learned and until next time stay well